Good morning, dear students. Today we are going to learn Unit Three, Computer Applications. In this chapter, mainly we will learn computer hardware. You know what is hardware? Hardware means it is a physical components of the computer. That means the parts of the computer, the machinery parts of the computer, or on the other hand, the parts which we can see and touch. For example, all the storage devices. Like a pen drive, we can see and we can touch pen drive, keyboard, mouse, all the input devices, all the output devices, like monitor, all these are examples of computer hardware. So we will learn so many hardware in this chapter. So we are going to learn the first category of the computer hardware, that is storage devices. What is storage devices? Storage devices mainly the devices which is used to store data. है ना? So storage devices का first storage device we are going to learn that is floppy disk. This floppy disk is also an example of computer hardware. What is floppy disk? Floppy disk it is a disk made of mylar plastic and enclosed in square plastic jacket. You can see the square plastic jacket. Inside this you can see my you cannot see that. I will show you that picture. Mylar plastic. Uh, plastic disk is there disk shaped and inside that data is storing it is 3.5 inch in diameter the capacity of this floppy disk is 1.44 megabytes which is less capacity in olden times it is used when we were in college that time we used to uh, store data with the help of this floppy disk only it is cheaper than other storage devices and it is portable also it is useful in transferring data from one computer to another computer. They are small, inexpensive, easy to store. Floppy disk is low cost device, particularly suitable for personal computer system. So, both pali use karte the or mylar plastic hai under this plastic disk. Hai. It is covered with a um, square plastic jacket se ka, uh, cover kiya hai, but it's uh, uh, storage capacity is very low that is 1.44 only see inside this plastic jacket you can see mylar plastic disc shaped inside this floppy disk i think it is clear our next storage device is hard disk i know you you might heard hard disk eh, na? somebody must have seen that hard disk also this uh, it looks like this way this hard disk its storage capacity is very high but than the floppy disk but it is fitted inside the computer you cannot see it directly because it is normally fitted inside the cpu if you want to see it you have to open the cpu then only you can see this hard disk it consists of one or more platers divided into concentric tracks and sectors may not be understanding now that means inside this uh, hard disk there is uh, two or more platers hoga. Usko track karke divide karte, then it is divided into a sector also it is mounted on a central spindle also i will show you that picture then it become more clear see this is the inside portion of this hard disk so hard disk and the this plater one plater two plater three plater four so many platers are there or mounted on a see the cylindrical cylindric spindle you can see in that spindle it is mounted and this plater also again it is subdivided platers ko how can we divide it can be divided into tracks this is first track then second track third track fourth track like this way it is divided into so many track har ek plater jo hai track karke divide karte and is track ko again sub divided into sector see this tarah ka this is called a sector yellow portion this is one sector this is another sector ye sab used sector hai normally data can be store data is storing in this sector sector mein store karte hai this red this all this indicates the sectors clear so this is the inside a portion of the uh, hard disk now this point it become more clear to you it consists of two or more platers divided into concentric tracks and sectors it is mounted on a central spindle like a stack it can be read by read right head that pivots across the rotating disk the data is stored on the platers covered with the magnetic coating this plater jo hai magnetic coating se covered hai. so data it is stored on this 
now what is hard disks are available that can store up to 1 terabyte of data uska storage capacity is very high 1 tb terabyte of data we can store in this uh, hard disk so the, here how the data is reading by using the read write head use karke read karte hai. so that also you can see in this picture hai na? inside portion hai, so many platers a platers hai. Um, the, here you can see read write head when it moves then this read write head with the help of this read write head we can read the data which is stored on the sector i think it is clear hard disk next storage device third storage device is compact disk very familiar isn't it compact disk or cd in short form cd they are optical media why it is known as optical media because optical technology is used to store the data that's why the CDs are cheap and have a storage capacity up to 700 MB only. There are, there are three types of CDs. Which are the three types of CDs? CD-ROM, CD-R and CD-RW. It's full form also, you know. CD-ROM means compact disk read-only memory. From the name itself, it is understood. Clear, no? That means the CD-ROM is used to store read information and cannot be used for stored data. If but information store, then already we can read only, we cannot write anything. Then CD are compact disk recordable. Sometimes blank CD we, we may get from the market. Like in who blank CD, if it is CD R wala CD hai, that means recordable hai, that means we can record only once. Ek bari record kar sakte, rewrite nahi kar sakte. Or one more type of CD is there, that is CD RW. RW ka matla compact disk rewritable hai. In this CD, we can write and we can delete also. If you wanted to write it again, that also we can do. That means multiple times we can write. Clear? Wrong. That means only read only. We cannot write even single once time also. We cannot write. Ek bar bhi write nahi kar sakte. CDR means once we can write, but afterwards we cannot write. CDRW means we can read and write. We can write many times. It, the CD storage capacity was 700 MB. <coughs> I think it is clear. Next, we are going to learn DVD. DVD, some, it looks like a CD only, isn't it? Yes, of course. DVD is also an optical storage device. Because here also, optical technology is using. Which looks like a compact disc. CD ke jisai dikne mein, hai na? So, DVD also three types of DVDs are there. First one, DVD ROM. Digital video disc. CD is full form compact disc. DVD ka digital video disc. Then DVD ROM means digital video disc read only memory. It's very high capacity optical disc. Hai. Compared to CDs se comparison mein DVD ka capacity is very high. CD mein 700 MB da. Here see 4.7 GB se leke 17 in GB tak we can store data. So DVD ROM means only we can read only. DVD R means recordable hai but only one time. DVD RW means rewritable hai. DVD rewritable that means data can write and read many times. I think it is clear. Next storage device is pen drive. So pen drive. You must have seen pen drive. Hai na? Pen drive they are also tiny devices which are about the size of a small pen which plug into usb port usb port mein plug karte hai. they vary in capacity and can store 1 gb to 1 tb high storage capacity hai na? due to their size they are more convenient and compact for backup and transferring data it's very small size eh? not like a cd or dvd and so we can convenient it's very convenient also and it is used for transferring data. Agar kisi ka backup rakna hai, to backup also we can store in this uh, pen drive. They are free from scratch and dust problem that exist in other storage media. It's very important. So, back storage media mein like a DVD, CD, SMA scratch ho gaya, to that uh, DVD will not work. But the, this pen drive is free from all these scratch problem. So, these are the storage devices so our storage devices over so thank you students please learn it i think it is clear to all of you